I'm outside of Atlas Cafe. I was recommended to me by someone on Twitter. I have no idea what part of town I'm in. All I knew is that I followed the directions to get here. It's super cute. And somewhere here it says that they have vegan treats. And I read online that they have vegan breakfast. So we're about to go inside. It's freezing, but it's a beautiful day in New York. And hopefully this will be delicious. We're about to have the mocha coffee with uh, soy milk. It looks delicious. We have them in our reusable mugs. Wow. That is one of the best mochaccinos I have ever had. Really? Yeah. That is really, really great. Mm. Well, the soy milk, I think, is actually really good extra flavor to have in there. And um, the foam is really great. And uh, it's just great. The coffee is really dense and delicious. I got an almond milk latte. Pretty good. It's a little watery. Um, it's got a good taste. It's just a little too watery for me. Oh, oh sure, sure. I'll lean for it. Yeah. As you can tell, this place is incredibly cramped, but it's really cute, really quaint. It's cozy. It's really cold outside. And it's just got this fun, it's so New York in here. Like, even the, the clientele, the people that work here, it's kind of like a little bit more, like, matter of fact and rushing and people not really paying attention to, like, who you are. But I kind of like that, you know, it's so different in Los Angeles. Um, so I love it. And there's so much to eat here, like, all along the walls. There's food options everywhere. And uh, we got some sort of vegan breakfast sandwich on a bagel and a crepe, which isn't for breakfast, but I never get to have vegan crepes, so I had to get that. And then they have this whole showcase of vegan desserts over there, so we're definitely going to have to try a lot. This is the vegan chicken crepe. The chicken itself is amazing. Oh my gosh, like full of flavor. Um, I think once I get more to the heart of the sandwich, it'll probably be a little bit more flavoring. Um, it almost seems like there needs to be some sort of sauce. Um, but the, like I said, the chicken, whatever whatever makes this chicken, is really good. How about the crepe? Mm, and the crepe is really well done, too. Wow. This is so good. Oh, my gosh. Mmm. So much flavor in this. There's some, like, vegan bacon and vegan A's and... I don't know what else, but this is just a great sandwich. The bagel's delicious. That's probably what it is. There's nothing beats a New York bagel, and this is just heavenly. You might have to get another one of these. I tried the crepe as well, and I agree with Mary. The chicken is fabulous, and the crepe itself is just really well done. Everything's great. This, I just knew when I walked into this place that their food was going to be good. It's just so authentic. I'm so happy to be in New York. We had an incredible experience at Atlas Cafe. This was the perfect first stop for us on this cold day. It was incredibly great service. Just a tiny little place in there, but I loved it. Um, the food was excellent, uh, really exceeded my expectations. You definitely have to try this place out, and all of their desserts are vegan, and they look incredible. <laughs> <laughs> so we're on the train, we're almost home, and I'm gonna have the um, red velvet cupcake now from Vegan Treats that I got at Atlas Cafe. Even hours later, this is fantastic. Still incredibly moist, and the frosting's incredible. So good. So glad I got this. Delicious.